for parties here present, Chairperson of the Commission, the members, uh, distinguished uh, ladies and gentlemen, um, a brief uh, update on the preparation of the 2016 uh, Register of Voters. And in this respect, the next stage is the inspection of the provisional register. Um, you will recall that uh, the registration of voters in preparation for the 2016 elections closed on 29th of February 2016. And uh, at that date, the Commission had registered over 1.6 million new uh, applicants. And another one, over 1.6 million, had applied for updates of various kinds, transfers or indeed replacements of their cards. Over 51,000 records, uh, applications were received to re remove records of uh, dead voters. The Commission proceeded to prepare the provisional register, and this included consolidation of all the new applications, uh, effecting the updates, removing the deceased, and indeed uh, identification and removal of all multiple registrations. We should advise that the provisional register is now ready, and the total figure stands at um, 6,710,455 um, registered voters on the provisional register of voters. Uh, you will be given a, a, a copy of this uh, schedule, so you may not need to write all the figures uh, just as I present. Um, you will note that uh, uh, the number of female voters is slightly more than male, with the number of female voters standing at 3.375 million, while those for male voters at 3.335 million. In terms of percentage distribution countrywide, just a quick overview is that we still have Lusaka province at 16.7%, representing the highest, followed by the Cover Belt at 15.5%, and then Southern Province at 12.1%. I won't go through all the uh, uh, 10, but to note that um, I think the least is uh, Mochinga province at 5.2%. The purpose of the inspection of the provisional register is to provide an opportunity for the electorate to verify the details and ensure that they, they, they are included on the register and accurately recorded, and also to enhance the accuracy of the register as we go for polls. Uh, the Commission has determined uh, seven days for this exercise, beginning 15 May, and it will run up to 21st May 2016. Or the 7,700, uh, for purposes of registration, they are called registration centers. For, for purposes of election, there will be polling stations will open for this exercise. I will repeat, so for the inspection, all the 7,700 polling stations countrywide will open for the inspection of the register. Except to say that each polling station will only have the segment of the register pertaining to that polling station. Uh, again, if uh, stakeholders would have, should have sight of the register for the entire district, this will be available with the office of the district electoral officer, and indeed for the entire national head office. Uh, besides the physical inspection, uh, the commission will provide for inspection via mobile phones through the short code 214 uh, on all the three networks. Final arrangements have been made. Um, this will be at no cost to the subscriber. The, survey, the, the register can also be inspected via the Commission website, so it will be uploaded in time for the 15th of uh, May 2016. In terms of what services will provide during these seven days? Of course, the primary, the principal activity is the verification of the details themselves on the register. Again, to note that the, the electoral voter registration regulations provide for inspection of an individual's details, but also in the register as a whole, so the 